director Moon Byung-gun received Palme d'Or at Cannes. The 66th Cannes International Film Festival commenced in Cannes, France on May 26, and Korean director Moon Byung-gun's short film Safe received the Palme d'Or Award. This is the first time for a Korean movie to receive an award in the short film category at Cannes. Director Moon Byung-gun is 30 years old and was previously invited to Cannes Critics Week event in 2011 with its graduation project, Finn O'Perry. Safe is his second film to make it to Cannes and his first to win an award. After receiving the award, director Moon Byung-gun said that this award motivated him to make his next movie. He added that he was scared when we thought of the pain he'd go through when writing future screenplays. There is light at the end of the long tunnel and we applaud his hard work and for writing a new page in the history of Korean films. Lee min first place on Japan's Oricon chart. After Lee min released the album My Everything in Japan on May 27 and it soared straight to the top on Japan's acclaimed Oricon Daily chart. This album isn't an official one for his activities as a singer, but it was a specially made album for his Korean and international fans. It is filled with six songs including My Everything and Always You. Songs by Kara, Dongbang Shingi, Boa, and Korean singers have all topped the Oricon chart in the past, but it is a rare occasion for a song released by an actor to grab top spot of the Oricon chart. A Japanese industry critic said that the popularity of Lee Mino can be seen through dramas and DVD sales, but the release of his first ever music album opened another market being uncovered by an actor. The critic added that the album is released as an anniversary version without any promotions, and he didn't make any broadcast appearances, so the results are pretty amazing. Meanwhile, Lee Mino embarked on his world tour with his concert in Seoul on May 25th. He will hold performances in Japan, Taiwan, Hong Kong, the Philippines, and other regions. It is scheduled to end in July. In Japan, he will be performing in Osaka on June 7th and in Yokohama on the 9th. Imino is set to star in the new drama, Those Who Want the Crown, Withstand the Weight of It, The Heirs. This drama is in the spotlight as it's the follow-up production of writer Kim Moon Suk, who created hits like Secret Garden and A Gentleman's Dignity. Lee min said that it was an honor to star in this drama and will concentrate on the drama once his world tour comes to an end. We hope he will do his best in his world tour and the drama. Kim Jang-un's successful U.S. concerts Singer Kim Jang-un started his U.S. tour and received positive reviews for his successful concerts in L.A. and New York. He sang many hits like Even Though the World Cheats You and others. He wowed everyone with the 200 ton equipment that flew in from Korea. The robot stage, the robot crane, and lights streaming out from the floor also impressed the audience. It was a passionate performance that drove the audience wild. Various message boards in the US and YouTube said that Kim Jong-un showed the true essence of K-pop performances. Plus, requests for anchor performances are pouring in on his US website. Like his reputation of a donation angel, Kim Jong-un made huge donations. Through his two performances in LA and New York, he donated a total of 160,000 US dollars to the Susan G. Komen Breast Cancer Foundation and the NYU Student Council. Kim Jong wowed everyone with his performances and good deeds. We wish him all the best. Girls' Generation Proven as World's Top Girl Group Korea's Top Girl Group Girls' Generation has been chosen as the number one girl group chosen by their international fans. U.S. music site Pop Dust did an online vote from May 9th to the 20th to choose today's greatest girl group. Eight internationally acclaimed girl groups were on the list and people had to choose the most popular group. Netizens from all over the world participated in the vote and it was made up of a total of three rounds. In round one, Girls' Generation won over popular American girl group Simorali. In round two, they competed against the British girl group this Saturdays and won again. The final round of the vote was against the U.S. girl group Fifth Harmony. Girls' Generation came in first place with 54% of the votes.